What's up, guys? Bruce here at Bullish Currency back at you with another crypto update. Today, we're going to talk about Kishu Inu, right? I know there's so many Inus, right? But it seems like the Inu, the Inus just keep feeding us. The Inus just keep giving us good moves. And we can't complain, to be honest, guys. We're blessed right now. Things are looking really good. So let's get right into it, guys. We're going to look at the chart of Kishu Inu. Guys, don't forget, like, comment, subscribe, guys, right? Hit the notification bell so that way you can be notified every time we drop a video because any one of these updates can be a, a huge, a huge, huge help, right? Uh, at the right time, you just never know. You just never, never, never know. All right, so right here, we're looking at the chart, guys. We're looking at the daily chart. And I want you to see where when Kishu Inu launched, man, it made a crazy move a lot of people got pretty rich off this move. I remember I, I was actually connected to communities and people who were involved. And then right around the time we got into a bear market with uh, Bitcoin for a little while, everything dropped. And I actually got in with my group down here in this area, right? Down here in this area. Uh, because I saw, at very obvious, price was started to break out. We broke out of this level, then we broke out of this level, and then we ultimately broke out even that, all those levels to the left. So that was screaming buy, 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 buy. And we knew just from where it was at compared to its previous all time high, even 50% of that move was a solid three to five X or more return. And that's exactly what happened, right? It literally, literally uh, where we got in, we were literally up, I believe beyond five X, six X, it was pretty big. I basically will have to do the math, but I know we were up pretty big. When I called it out in my community and I said, hey, man, Kishu Inu looks like it's ready uh, to make another move, another bull run, and sure enough, it did. Now, right now, you know, if you're currently still in, in Kishu and you got in down there, you're still, you're still good. You're still looking really good. But look where we are right now. We have a retracement down to the 786 in between two, tre two trend line possibilities. And we're literally at a level. And ultimately, if we look, we're, we're at, we're, this is basically a break in retest, right? Because you guys know, I like to highlight my retest zone. So if I went right here to the nearest wick and I just dragged this straight, the nearest tallest wick straight across, that wick right there, you see, all wicks matter, right? So you see, boom, we're right here in that zone. So this is a good buying area. Um, as of today, Kishu Inu, and as of the, the whole entire last week or so, it's been bearish, right? So, uh, but look where we are. The last time we came in this area, we had a, a very big rejection followed by a big bullish engulfing. So what we could see happening right now is, is that a lot of buyers are going to start rolling in right now into Kishu Inu, knowing this is a great time to buy because this can easily give us another bullish move like this, like it did last time. And if it does, guess what? It's actually going to form a big old W, which is one of my favorite bullish patterns. So we're looking really good. I mean, we're looking good. We're in a great buy area right now. I'm not telling you what to do with your money. Once again, guys, you guys know this is not financial advice. This is just for entertainment education purposes. You do whatever you want to do. But this is what me and the bullish currency community is doing. This is what we're looking at. This is how I see it. And I just look, I, I see it as a wonderful, personally for myself, a wonderful buying opportunity for Kishu Inu. Okay, so definitely want to keep your eye on that. Let's go take a look at some numbers, right? Let's go take a look at some data. All right, so here we go. So as of today, you know Kishu Inu is down, right? It's been down today in general. Now, for those who don't know, you can get this obviously swapping Ethereum on MetaMask, all right? So if you guys don't know how to do that, I'm sure there's plenty of YouTube videos. So right now, you know, look at the market caps, 400 and, uh, 445 million, right? And then look at the volume. Volume is at 18 million in the last 24 hours. So the numbers are looking really good, all right? So let's go down here and take a look at the holders. So look at that. The holders are steady increasing. Steady, steady, steady increasement, increasing. So if it keeps going in this direction where every single day they're gaining, you know, approximately 1K to 2K or, you know, somewhere around there, uh, increase of holders, that is actually great. And I think this is a great buy-in area, great buy zone. So let me take a look at the monthly. So I, I'm, I know for sure this is going to increase. 
Oh, I'm looking at the wrong chart. Sorry, guys. Here we go. It's up here. Okay. Okay. Yeah, so the, so the monthly looks good. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, guys. I like it. I like everything about it. I like where it's at. I like everything. I already, we already, here at Bullish Currency Community, we already got in really early. So we're all, we're lit. We're good. Uh, but that's what I see, guys. It's just a quick update. I see a, a, cons, a very obvious just retracement to the 786 area. Probably going to retest this trend area. Probably going to retest this previous resistance level. Uh, but overall, this whole zone here, uh, we can go very bullish, very fast in this area like we did before. If history repeats itself, all right? And that's what happens a lot of times in the market, guys. So that's it for this video, guys. Keep an eye on Kishu Inu and anything with a freaking Inu at the, at, the, at the end of it. I'm not telling you to just jump into anything with Inu. They definitely do your research, do your due diligence. You have to understand certain things so that you can avoid being scammed you know, in these crazy crypto spaces, but there's definitely, definitely profits to be made if you know what you're doing. All right. So if you don't know what you're doing, the best thing to do is to get with people who know what they're doing, guys. And you're more than welcome to join the bullish currency community. Simply leave a comment below or email us or whatever. Uh, and we'll definitely get back to you on how you can become a member of the bullish currency community, guys. Until then, I'll see you guys on the next video. Stay blessed and stay bullish.